She got it all in my eye. What? Um, oh. That whipping cream. I don't think I ever really had like a bad cheese. You? Yeah, out of my ass. What's up, YouTube? YouTube. Welcome, Welcome back, back to our channel. channel. It's Kelly Sam. You already know it's your boy Sam. Alright, y'all. So, as y'all can see from the title, we are getting in the kitchen today. Yes, we are. We are currently in the parking lot getting ready to go into the grocery store to go get all of the items that we need for, yes, macaroni and cheese. I love macaroni and cheese. It's one of my number one favorite things. Me too. But my body doesn't always agree with it, okay? Yours? Well, I'm lactose. Yeah, so. but I'm the opposite. So if you know what that means, then you know, then you know. But I'm trying to learn how to do this the vegan way. But today we are not going to cook it the mm -hmm. vegan way we, we because I don't know how to do it real fully cheesy that way. way. I have multiple different ways. Like sometimes I make a cheese sauce. Sometimes I just like shred major cheese. They want to. They want to see the I best way right ways. now. They want to see the best homemade. I know, right but now. I haven't made it for a while. So like when you stop making it, because I don't want to eat it too much, because it's not really that good for you. Um, not that I'm not confident of making it, but I forgot which way is the best. Which way do you think is the best? What, however way that you make is the best. But the, we, there's like five different ways. I didn't know there's five different ways. I thought you just had one way. Because some some of them you can do with the egg. Some of them you can do without the egg. Some of them you can do with that little Velveeta cheese. Some of them you can't what, do without look, that. Look, what I want to see them, and what they want to see is the, the cheesiest, cheese best, super soft noodles super good tasting way that's why we're gonna make it today i mean they're Homemade. all gonna be tasty but all right so probably like a cheese sauce so we about to put everybody on game of showing you guys our secret Wait, way you, mean me. you by by us well by her showing her way of making her secret homemade mac and cheese let's go get the ingredients all right y'all so we have pepper jack cheese yeah <laughs> Mozzarella cheese, and I actually have two mozzarella cheeses, so you know you have to have the mozzarella cheese. A uh, big block of sharp cheddar cheese, uh, Kobe Jack cheese, and this is going to be a Kobe Jack just to like put on top of it. One, two, three. That's a lot four, of cheese. Five. It's like a five cheese of mac and cheese. So we're about to get the rotini noodles because all of the elbow macaroni is gone, so it's gonna get these rotini. I like elbow though. What about the elbow? Okay, well, we're not gonna get those. We're gonna get these. We just got back home. Let's start whipping it up. All right, guys, as you guys know, we got the water boiling right now. As you know, that's like the first step on making your mac and cheese. Again, we got mozzarella cheese, pepper jack. Another mozzarella cheese, Colby Jack, and sharp cheddar cheese. And what else do we got? Butter, a stick of butter. We have heavy whipping cream. These are just some seasons. I don't know if I'm gonna use all of them. Um, garlic salt, adobo, Cajun seasoning, garlic powder, some salt, and some cracked black pepper. Y'all know I don't cook, so. So I'm gonna be like a helper pretty much in this video, but. We about to put y'all on game with her homemade secret on this mac and cheese because it's just, it's amazing and it's just cheesy, it's so good. So we had got the rotini at the grocery store, so Sammy was having a debate, so he didn't want to use the rotini, but I, really I don't feel it. like there's nothing wrong. Comment down below if you like rotini or elbow noodles and why. Okay, so actually These are the ones that I wanted right Yeah, there. so we're going to be using the elbow macaroni instead. So there's not that much left in here, but I think this box, Is it gonna be enough? Yeah. Do we have to mix this it? This box is only 16 ounces and this one is 32 ounces, but this one is like kind of halfway full. So it might have 16 ounces of it. I don't know. We're gonna put a little bit of salt in here. What kind of salt is that? Is this pink salt? Yeah. So you just put Himalayan salt, pink salt? So we're gonna put some of the organic coconut oil. Ooh. Just a little bit because it just helps the noodles with like sticking and stuff. That should be enough. I don't know how much that is because as y'all can see, it's crumbled up. Sometimes I actually do put chicken broth instead of water with the noodles just to give it an extra flavor. But today we're going to be using water. Do we have chicken broth? 
But that is also another way that you could definitely do that with. Do we have yeah. chicken broth? Yes, we do. Because that's well, why we use it. I mean, did you want to pour some of the water out and put the chicken mm. broth in? It? Actually, I think it's a little bit less. It's the organic chicken broth. So, actually. Can so, this is that. all these seasons and stuff is just for the flavor? Yeah, it's just, it makes your mac and cheese. Also, y'all, I did forget that I wanted to. I probably, if we have it in there, if we don't, it's fine. But I like to do sour cream. That is a special thing. Not everybody does that, but sour cream and y'all mac and cheese. Mm. All right, there is no sour cream, baby. Now, if I look in there and there's some sour there's cream. There's no sour cream, so we're gonna have to exclude that now, ingredient. See. I told you there's none in the hair. Do y'all girls be doing that to y'all boyfriends? If we check first and then be like, oh, I don't think he checked good enough. So you guys go check. Oh, that's exactly what I thought. Oh, you ain't fine now. <laughs> like, that's what I'm saying. So you just bit your own tongue. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't really searching, that's why. Y'all, he always does this. So when I have a gut feeling, I always go with my gut feeling. Now, I know he didn't check all the way and I knew there was sour cream in there. That's why I, that's why I did that. All right, so let's see how it looks. Okay, looking good. So for this one, I actually decided to do a cheese sauce. All right, guys, so I'm also getting ready to do the cheese sauce. So if you guys don't know, um, just to make everything a little bit more thicker and more of a sauce consistency, you're going to want to use flour and you're going to want to use some butter, okay? All right, so I have like two um, tablespoons of butter right now. So I'm just gonna put it in there and it's gonna melt and then we're gonna put a little like two we're gonna put like two tablespoons of the flour so it's gonna be yeah y'all just gonna see okay bam gotta put some more in there whoa y'all see how it's bubbling see it. I see all right it. I'm gonna put a little bit more Ooh, that's weird that's a lot of bubbles all right now this this process you can't have it too hot so I actually have the, the heat on low all the way low yeah, all low. Have it all low. And y'all have to consistently be stirring it because if y'all make it like a little. You had another scoop? No, just a little bit. Y'all see, I don't be measuring. I'm sorry. <laughs> so, we're going to put some of this. What is some of this? What is that? You got to shake it up like shake that? It. Oh, that's heavy whipping cream? Yeah, heavy whipping cream. Oh, you I just, just burnt myself. Yo, <laughs> yo. I just burnt myself. She got it all in my eye. What? Um, oh. That whipping cream. Damn. I heard so for this, you definitely want to just put a little bit in as you go. Uh, that was not a little bit, right? All right. Yes, like this. Look. Remember, y'all, she does not Look. measure anything. You don't need no measurements <laughs> no. for the special mac and cheese. No, I just don't. Oh my gosh, I really burned my arm. You almost burned my eye. All right, them noodles are ready to Let me taste one. No, you don't cook them all the way because they're gonna bake in the oven. Ooh. I'm done with this uh, beginning process for the cheese sauce. Now he needs to cut the cheese and then we're gonna grate some of them also. All right, so this is going to be the first batch of all the cheese that we had just grated. We didn't grate all the cheese yet. I said the first batch. The first cube. I said the first batch. All right, so what do we do with that? Go okay, we're going to put it in here. I don't think I ever really had like a bad cheese. You? Yeah, out of my ass. <laughs> All 
Alright, that's that for I cut my finger. That's mozzarella. Go ahead and add that in there. Let's see what it looks like. Oh. Alright. All right, y'all, so this is going to be the pan that we're using for the mac and cheese. We're gonna get the butter. Y'all, I love butter. I could literally just eat like half of this stick. Don't right do now. that. That's I'm disgusting. Just, I'm just gonna eat a little bit. No, don't do that. Don't do it. Mm. That's so nasty. So nasty. I love butter. And my son, Cairo, he loves butter too. He Yeah, he you would taught just, him how to love butter. He'd be like this. No, it's just natural. He has it in him. That's what he likes. All right, so we're gonna actually, this knife is poop, so it did not cut. <laughs> just like flatten so it. So we're just gonna do it like that. We're gonna save this little piece of butter. So we're gonna butter our pan like this. That's enough. The rest is just gonna go in my mouth. <laughs> Dude. How's it going? Oh, now y'all can see. Oh, look. That now that's oh. some cheesy ass cheese. It's very, very cheesy. Let me taste it. Ew, why you got your pinky out like that? That's not enough. That's not enough. You know how I eat with cheese. I still gotta eat but it. But you're gonna eat it. I'm gonna have a shitty night. <laughs> We're gonna drain the noodles. Which we should have been there because they're getting a little hard. Get with the seasonings a little bit of garlic salt, some garlic powder, black pepper, cracked black pepper. Not the pepper from the dollar store, not the pepper from the cheapest shaker that you could find, the actual cracked black pepper. Yeah, I heard it, man. Because the other pepper be tasting like toxic powder. I'm gonna add a little bit of Cajun just to get a little spicy. Okay. Wait, I don't want it spicy, man. Uh, I just want to cheat. So we're gonna put some of this butter. More butter. Yeah. So we're gonna. On top of the noodles? Mm. Oh, mix it in with the noodles. Oh, wow. Uh, so we're gonna put a little dab. It's not a little, a little dab. A little dab of adobo in here, okay? I'm over here mixing it with my knife. We're gonna shred all the rest of the cheese. We're gonna put it on top. Oh, actually, I forgot. We're gonna put some sour cream in next. All right, so we're gonna add some of the sour cream, just like this. I'm gonna mix it all throughout, so I'm gonna put a couple more scoops. All right, guys, she finished all of her finalized touches. Y'all see how it looks. Looks amazing, like I yes. said. Yes, y'all already know. I told y'all to come get with car. We will see y'all when it comes out. Oh my no. gosh. Look at that. Look. The top got a little crispy. I see that. <laughs> oh my gosh. No. Oh my. Oh. Cairo, you want first bite? You want the first bite? No. Okay. I'll take <laughs> it. Come on, one. Yeah. Stop, stop, Cairo. Come on. I'm gonna say one, one two, two, three. Y'all, this just came out the oven too, so it's very hot. It very, very yet. hot. And yeah. this he wanted is. He wanted to automatically just. The watch out, pop is hot. Amazing. Oh my. Yeah, yeah. God. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you want some? You want, it's hot. Here, I'll give you a little piece. Yeah, yeah he just came out the hot too. Here, here you go. Oh, yeah, you love hot. it. Here, open it's the mouth. Hot. Can I try? How does it taste? You want to try too? Um, 
How is it? Daddy, me and Mark. You want more? Let's go. Me and Mark. Be careful, Mama's trying it. Me and Mark. What is that? Me and Mark. Me and Mark. I hope you guys followed all those steps so you can enjoy your mac and cheese too. And we'll catch you guys in the next video.